Hey gut! Hey guys, so today I wanted to do another pets updates video. I like doing these types of videos because I get to show all of my pets in one video and I think you guys enjoy that too because some people like um, saffron, some people like to see the rabbits, and my, the majority of my channel is usually revolving around hamsters because that's what a lot of people want to see. But when I do videos like this, you get to see all of the animals so then it can satisfy everybody's needs. So I first have Saffron out here with me. He's doing great. He's been loving his bioactive enclosure. I've added some more uh, Apothos vines in there for him. My mom has a ton of them growing up in our kitchen and they're like 20 years old, so they're huge. So I've just like wrapped a very large one around the cage, but he's been loving it. And I really love the isopods in there. I just think they're so cute, even though I hate bugs. I think they're adorable. Say hi. You're so cute. So as of today, the rabbits are doing really good. Um, a couple of days ago though, Lola actually um, wasn't feeling too well. She kind of gave us a little bit of a GI stasis scare. So basically she didn't want to eat anything. She did look a little uncomfortable, um, like she possibly had gas. And when she goes into that type of state, she becomes untouchable. So she will run away from you and won't let you touch her at all. Thankfully, I did have some Medicam on hand. Um, Medicam is basically a pain medication uh, that you can give rabbits and it generally will help because when a rabbit gets GI stasis, they generally have gas bubbles um, in them. And when a rabbit gets a little bit of gas, some rabbits are more sensitive than others and some <laughs> will just totally shut down <laughs> almost and they kind of just don't want to eat anything which isn't good a rabbit needs to be always eating or most of the time they need to be eating um, so the medicam basically just helps them to relieve any pain and then it generally helps them to get back to eating so at 2 in the morning I had to chase Lola around which I'm sure she absolutely hated me I got scratched up a ton yeah Lola you scratched me a ton <laughs> And I finally caught her in the towel and I was able to give her, give her Medicam. And then literally I woke up with both of them on my bed. Are you scared? I woke up with both of them on my bed and Lola was feeling back to herself. So I actually wanted to show you guys this big tunnel haven that 101 Rabbits sent me. For some reason it's very expensive to get these cardboard bunny accessories here in Canada. Like this tunnel I think would have costed $40 or something like that to get. And here's Lola. They love their tunnel. It usually isn't in my room uh, because it is huge so I usually keep it out in the basement area when they are playing so that they can play in it. But I just brought it in here to show you guys. Then we have our princess Isabella sleeping on her couch. She is getting a lot slower. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you would have seen that we actually bought her a wagon because she has a really hard time keeping up when she goes for walks. And we like to go to the park a lot and take her with us. So it's really hard to walk her when she's going so slow. So now she has a wagon to ride in, which she's still practicing how to like not want to jump out of it, but she's doing pretty good with it and it's really hilarious to pull your dog in a wagon. Um, I feel like it's pretty extra, but anything for my animals. <laughs> here we have my little garden for my animals. We have some romaine lettuce in this pot. 
I think this is basil. I don't know what this one is, some type of herb. It might be thyme or parsley. And then we have some cat grass here. This is very wilted. It's gonna go to one of the hamsters, but it just needed a bit of water. And then up here we have more romaine lettuce. So because it is summer, that means we have a willow season, so I can pick some willow and then dry it out and give it to the hamsters. Do you like your willow? Willow is a great healthy snack for hamsters and rabbits and other small animals. Um, it's very, very healthy for them, so, and a lot of them do enjoy it. Is that good? Excuse me, miss. I'm trying to show stuff in your cage and and you're trying to escape. That's not very helpful. Look at how cute. So these little ledges here are just ordered off of Amazon. So they're wood slices actually. There's one there, one right there, and then one by the sand bath. And I've glued down some uh, dowels on the ends of them and then I've stuck them onto there and they're really good ledges for the hamsters. Miss? Yeah, thank you for getting down. No. You're... Look at all the poop. She likes to poop on her. <laughs> on top of her hideout. Beautiful. I can see you struggling very much. You want to come out. Hello. That's not for chewing, but okay. If you guys didn't know, Bumble actually turned a year old on June 10th. I can't believe I've had her for a whole year. It's insane. We have an escaped hamster. Hey, get back here. Miss, ma'am. Miss, ma'am, get back here. Hi, Miss Honey. What are you doing on top of the hideout? Just exploring. I'm going to give you some willow now. So another reason I really like willow is that it just makes the cage pop. It makes it look a lot more natural with the green. It just gives it like this natural color or look and I really love it. So Honey is doing really, really well. She wants to come out obviously because she's being a little spider ham here. I know you wanna come out really bad, but here you can have this little hammy treat. Oh, that you pouched. Okay. <laughs> You're so funny. And here is Honey's little uh, log, log ledge. I don't know what to exactly call them, <laughs> but I really like them. The hamsters seem to like sitting on them and like eating things. So I think they're really cute. Look at this little cutie. She was just grooming herself. Oh, are you gonna, are you tired? She's like closing her eye. <laughs> She's like, go away. I wish you guys, oh, oh, oh. She almost fell over. I wish you guys could see. She's like picking up her foot and cleaning it. It's very adorable. But the bowl is in the way. Are you just staring off into space? I want to know what you're thinking. What are you thinking about? Well, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video and seeing all of the pets. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!